Curiosity and exploration are vital to the human spirit. Going to the moon was inspiring to a whole generation. The generation that's to come is really excited about the future of space. They have curiosity that they want to explore. So this is their rocket. So Space Launch System is the heavy lift launch vehicle that's gonna take humans and cargoes to deep space, beyond Earth's orbit, maybe to an asteroid and then on to Mars. It's the largest vehicle ever planned or that exists today. It's gonna to tower 384 feet tall, about 38 stories. The total vehicle weighs about six and a half million pounds. So if you can imagine 22 elephants in the payload, Space Launch System has nine million pounds of thrust. That's 208,000 engines all being fired at one time. That's the kind of lift capability that SLS has to have. Space Launch System will launch from Kennedy Space Center. As it enters into orbit, the boosters will fall off, a core stage will fall back to Earth, and then the upper stage will thrust Orion into deep space. Orion is the multi-purpose crew vehicle. It's the human habitat in which our astronauts will live in that'll take them to Mars, and we will use advanced technologies like solar electric propulsion that will launch us to Mars. It's gonna take about a two to three year mission cycle to get to Mars. So much like Saturn V had many missions to get to the moon, with early stages of Gemini and the many Apollo missions, so will SLS to get to Mars. Uh, we are building the capability for a Mars landing in 2030. Going to Mars is hard, but can you imagine the things that we're gonna learn along the way? We're building these technologies. We will become self-sufficient in our vision and our exploration to Mars. We will be able to use that kind of self-sufficiency. The battery technologies that we'll find in solar electric power will enable us to become more efficient here on Earth. There are so many mission opportunities. If we wanted to launch a telescope that's larger than Hubble, we can do it with less missions. If we want to go to an asteroid, if we want to circle Europa, those are the kinds of places that SLS will have a capability to go. It's wide open. I want to see the first launch. I'd be so excited to shake the astronaut's hand and tell him that I worked on SLS. Roger, Houston.